Hey, welcome to Brokehouse Gamer. My name's Andy. This is my very first show, so I'm going to see how I go. Now, I'm a newly acquired collector. I literally just started a, ooh, about a week or so ago, thanks to my wife, who uh, just uh, saw a cr ads on Craigslist for this little beauty. Yep, that's right, the Nintendo Entertainment System. Now, to be honest, I never ever had one of these when I grew up. I started off with Commodore Amiga. That was a fun little system in its own right. But this is what I got, and it came with all the cables and wires, and everything works great. And of course, I also got a stack of games. And that's it, uh, I'm just gonna quickly go through a couple of the games. Also two controllers, just to keep this short and sweet. Now, everybody, everybody always has this game. Now, first time I really honestly played it, uh, apart from various uh, things on the, the Wii, the virtual console that they have. But, of course, uh, it was great fun. And I have to admit, I'm not very good at it. It uh, takes me a while to uh, really get going. And, uh, of course, uh, ooh, Tailspin. And, yeah. <laughs> Dragon Powers. Now, this is interesting. Hmm. No idea what half these games really are, because I never really played the system. Now, there's Tag Team Wrestling. I have no idea about half these games. It's kind of fun. Journey to Solaris. Rescue the Embassy Mission. Looks kind of fun. Kung Fu. And of course, Metroid. A really bad faded copy of Top Gun. Commando. Football. Well, because I'm English, well, this doesn't really help me do anything, really. No interest in football. But, of course, I love the movie. It's a bit of a dirty copy. I'm going to see about cleaning that up. And I'll give this a go at one point. I mean, ugh, look at all the dirt. If you can just about make it out in there, it's horrible. But I love the movie. Star Soldier. Looks like a little shoot 'em up. That's all graphics. Hmm. Bad dudes. Now I remember having this. I had a conversion for the Amiga, and I really enjoyed playing that one. I haven't played this one, so I'll give this a crack soon. Popeye, arcade classic series. I don't know much about this. I know the character. So uh, I'll give it a go, see if it works. Snake Rattle and Roll. And uh, it's got written bad, because if you can hear it, it shakes a little bit, and there's a couple of bits rattling around in there. So at some point, I may have to look into that. And Dino Wars. No idea, it looks like a shoot 'em up um, The Simpsons, Bart versus the Space Mutants. Ah, it looks like it was a fun little platformer. I seem to remember playing at a friend's house long ago. And Batman. That's going to be a good little platformer. WrestleMania. Interesting. And a bit of soccer. Oh no. The goal. And a weird case of baseball. I'll be high baseball. No idea really why it's in a completely different case, but I'm guessing different manufacturers and all sorts. Pro wrestling. That looks very old. <laughs> And I have another Mario. Oh, okay. Up 
Operation Wolf. Now, I remember this from the arcades with a big old Uzi machine gun. And you're shooting everybody. And we're going to see what the NES version looks like. And of course, why not? The Little Mermaid. Side pocket. Nice little pool game. Quarterback. There we go. We can have a American football game. And another baseball. Marble Madness, a classic. I remember this for quite a while. I remember on the, again the Amiga. I, remember, I think it's had quite a few uh, entries. Probably the best platformer again, Super Mario Bros. 3. I played this on the Wii Virtual Console. And uh, I was quite good on that. I was, uh, quite enjoyed that one. And last but not least, Cubit. And his weird and funny sayings. Now, all of this, two controllers, all the cables, uh, my wife got me. And I'm now converted into a little game collector. So what I'm hoping to do is to buy a little couple of games, a couple of consoles as I go along. And I'm keeping these videos very short. Because I yes, a lot of the uh, YouTubers, they kind of rattle along for like 30 minutes. But of course, this is the start of my collection. This is it. This is all I have apart from, again, a PS4, which I have uh, underneath my TV right now. I only have about six games for it. It's, uh, again, mainly being used by kids for their DVD playing purposes, funnily enough. But yeah, no, I'm really excited. I'm starting to learn quite a lot. And uh, so I've only been going a couple of weeks. And this is my first little haul. I'm, I'm quite excited. So, hopefully, um, every week I should be able to post a little bit more. And I'll be shopping on eBay and hopefully getting some really cheap deals. But uh, I hope everything's cool. Thank you very much.